Cicada is, we designed it to be one of the first electroacoustic synthesizers. Hi, I'm Herbert Chang. I'm a third year PhD student at USC Annenberg, and this is Cicada, a music instrument that I co-invented. What it does is it like converts electric signals into precise mechanical motions. As a result, it becomes an electronic sound or electronic music that you can physically touch and modulate with your hands. Around seven years ago um, at Dartmouth, where I was an undergrad, I met my co-inventor, um, Spencer Topel, who was a music professor. One of the things that we feel like electronic instruments really lack is um, the precise touch of, say, acoustic instruments. So for instance, when you're playing the violin, sub subtly changing how you like finger a string or you bow, um, for instance, all will dramatically change the output of sound and the timbre and the color of sound that comes out. My contribution was basically converting like mathematical formula, which is the motion of this bridge, into the signals that would be produced. And so for me, the most gratifying part of playing with and designing the instrument is being able to, you know, weigh both the logical, you know, mathematical equation, signally side of music, but also with the more intuitive and why does this matter for musical production aspect and trying to find the middle ground. As like instrument designers, we're not necessarily the musicians. And so when we release these two musicians, they find really creative ways to use it. The Guthman Musical Instrument Competition is known as the X Prize for Music Instrument Design. During our performance at the the competition, like we drove this through like a Chinese like instrument called the Gu Qin. We drove it through the string, and that sounded really ethereal and really beautiful. Typically, there are three prizes, and then also a special jury prize. We won the special jury prize, which was really fantastic. All this like technology, this concept, the theory was developed like in my undergraduate years. Um, so if my undergrad was about theory, developing this as a as a graduate is about practice. The core of my research program is really human machine interaction. Most of the stuff I do in communication is with um, you know misinformation, social media distortion of, through like AI or social bots. But that's again like really heavy stuff. And so having a way to explore this also very core part of my identity that's more artistic and introspective is really gratifying for me.